Hello everyone, this is Sanjay Parashar. Welcome back to our channel, Integration Guru. And I hope you guys are doing good. So before we start this session, uh, I would like to inform you guys that we have recently started an another series where we are covering important concept of uh, integration. We have recently uploaded a video on WSDL, which is Web Service Description Language. So if you guys have not seen that yet, I highly recommend you guys to check that out because uh, today I will be working with WSDL having multiple operations and same was demonstrated on that video. The audio of that video is a bit messy, but we'll try to improve on quality of audio as well as video. So today's agenda is to expose a web service having multiple operations and each operation performs a different task. And whenever we have this sort of requirement in Oracle SOA, there is an activity called pick activity which comes in handy and we will be using that only in today's session. So let's start with the development of the service. So I have created one project called calculator demo where I have used the schema which takes two numbers as input and one number as a result. And this is uh, the visual that has been created which has two operations addition and subtraction which takes one input output based on the schema that I just showed you guys. So we have this blank composite here. So at the exposed service side, service side we will be using uh, a SOAP adapter because we want to expose our service, uh, expose our web service uh, as a SOAP service. We will give a relevant name here, let's say calculate web and now we will be giving this a location to that particular visitor which is calculator demo I'll take it here port type is operations as I showed you guys in visitor we'll click on ok so our soap adapter has been created having two operations addition and subtraction and this will be exposed to the outer world for anyone to use now in component section we will be using people process and we will define service later we click on ok after making a wire we will open our people process so here the first activity will have to be pick activity because pick activity uh, supports multiple operations so in pick activity so first of all we will have to check this create instance because we want to tell our compiler that this is the first activity from where the code needs to be compiled now in pick activity we have two options on alarm and on message so on message is the one which works on operations so based on whatever operation user will choose flow will go to that particular operation and on alarm is time driven so after a certain amount of time if we want one branch or one flow to be executed then on alarm will be used so here we have this on message we can uh, create multiple on messages based on how many operations we have we have two operations at the moment so we will be using two on messages here and under the partner link we will select calculate web which we created which has been exposed and we will create a variable for input and for addition operation like this similarly in the second tab we will use the we will select the partner link however the operation we will choose as subtraction so in nutshell whenever user want to add anything the flow will come to this particular branch and whenever user wants to subtract the flow will come into this branch so now we will need to define the logic accordingly 
so we will use reply activity to reply back the result I think it was addition so reply addition and create this variable addition output variable and we want to reply subtraction as well we will change the operation subtraction and we'll create a variable here so now we have the input variable stored under this on message and output variable stored under this reply we will simply need to assign assign addition this is the addition result and we want to add number one and number two now we will assign the subtraction so here is the output variable of subtraction and here are the input variables of subtraction so the basic code basic structure is ready and now we are ready to deploy this service and to demonstrate to you guys how multiple operations look like in enterprise manager so let's deploy it as we can see the service has been deployed and now let's test it so here we can see that calculator demo has been deployed and now we'll try and test it so now when we test it you can see that operations are here so whenever we want to test it we can select operation from here so for now uh, and so let's start with addition let's add 10 and 20 and the answer is 30 now let's test subtraction then let's 20 and 10 and the answer is 10 so this is it guys um, that's how you expose a web service having multiple operations and a different business logic with each operation and thank you so much for your time you take good care of yourselves and have a nice day ahead bye bye